Hey everybody, uh, this is Ryan and Tareen. Today we're gonna make the stylus. I'm here with Rudy and Eli, or Eli and Rudy, depending on how you wanna look at it. It's just a twist on a classic 50-50 martini. We're gonna start with an ounce and a half of the Bombay Sapphire Gin. Okay, so gin is gonna go in the, this yeah. guy. That, somebody the was paying one. attention. Yeah. Woo! This is what it's going into. That's it's going into the jigger. the only thing he's gonna get right. Yep, <laughs> let's get it, let's get it. Ounce and a half of the Bombay Sapphire. Pour that right into your pint glass. We're gonna do three quarters of an ounce of a traditional dry vermouth. I definitely recommend Noily Pratt Original French Dry. Dig it. Very nice. We're gonna do three quarters of an ounce of a traditional vermouth. Oh, go shit. Out there. there we go. Oh, there we go. Boy. Oh, I already oh, fucked it up. Yeah, you are just. Where do I put this? In your mouth. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Three quarters of an ounce right in there. We're gonna do a quarter of an ounce of a medium dry sherry. Oh, that's called oh, breakfast. Boy. Now you're just, you've given up. That's what that, that's what's happening. That's nice though. Are you it's okay? Really nice. oh, it's you, funky. It's it? woody. It's, I like it. That's perfect. This is you nice. Got, that's it. Let's do it. Pour an ounce right there. So this is acting as our bittering agent. Push it's looking good. Yeah. So we're gonna set an anchor. So two whole cubes, Oops. not Oops. three. I said two. Oops. So we theoretically washed our hands before this. We definitely did. We got it. Right. <laughs> well, whatever. We're drinking. My our cubes own are drinks. melting, guys. <laughs> Can you just grab two cubes? <laughs> we're gonna gently set them in, nice and light. There we go. Look at you guys. So let's break them. So we're adding now surface area, because we want to get some dilution. I like the way you splash. If we just dumped in only these whole, uh, you would end up with not enough surface area. The drink would get cold before it was properly diluted. If we dumped in all broken ice, the drink would get way diluted before it was ever cold. Now we're gonna set in like three or four more. You're just gonna cap it off. Using our two fingers, right. uh, and we're just, uh -huh. we're just going back and forth, nice and gentle. You pretty much already got it, which is amazing. You're hired. I've never seen anyone get it that fast. What about this guy right here? No, you are. What about this little. You are still. What about this finger dally right yeah, here? Yeah, struggling. You are not a good lover. I'm I've assuming. done. I've done this before. I've also heard that before. Thanks. <laughs> Let's stop. Leave your spoon in there. Let's hang out. Because as we're stirring, we're agitating a little bit. We're increasing dilution, but we also want to get it nice and cold. So we're putting it in a classic cocktail goblet. The reason for that is you don't want a lot of surface area for it to warm up in. For most people, this is a bit of a garish glass. When you say garish, what does uh, that mean? Uh, well, is that English? it means that you get to go look in the dictionary. All right. Yeah. Can we annotate There's that? There's a lot yeah, of lower thirds okay. on this video. I think right down here, it's going to say garish now. Garish now. <laughs> Isn't it? I mean, it would be like an adjective, right? OK, whatever. Um, yeah, I don't know. We're going to strain this off right out of the pint glass and into the glass. Mm, very nice. Our finishing touch is gonna to be an orange twist. We're gonna start at the top, go all the way down. Boom, boom. Just shooting the oils out over the top of the drink. Slide it getting in. Getting a little on the rim. So this is the stylus. A 50-50 martini. 50-50 martini. Los Angeles. Oh yeah, mine's good. Yours is gonna taste weird. Wait, you should try no, ours, no, no. right? Yeah, I'll try yeah, yours. Yeah, I'll try, try it. Then, this is poison. No, no, then I'm like, try yours. Yeah, please. Season. Dude, this is good. You nailed it. All yeah. right. Yeah. Uh, Woo! If you get these classic recipes, do them at home. You can make martinis. You can make Manhattans. You can make better than what you get out a lot of times. Cheers to the bar. Cheers to the bar. Cheers the bar. I appreciate it. Thank you, guys. Thanks for coming by. Thank you.